Hey guys, what's up? It's Allison. Welcome back to my channel. Long time no see. I haven't filmed in two weeks and I miss you guys so much. My hair is different. My mom did my knotless braids. I love them so much. Um, yeah, let's just get into the videos. So today's video is going to be a haul video. I got all the items from Shein. Basically all the items are more like summer items because you know summer's not over and we still got places to go. Well, kind of because you know, we're in the middle of a pandemic. I think most of the items that I got are super cute. Some of them are a little questionable. So if you guys want to see what I got, then just keep watching. All right, starting off with these jeans. They fit a little bit looser than I expected, but I feel like this is low key a look. So I still really like it. Then I got this graphic tee. It just says California. What does that say? California dreaming. It's so cute. I love the pink detailing on it. Then it just has this tropical detailing on the back. Both super, super cute. I feel like this top looks so much better laid out than on. I'm going to show you guys real quick how it looks. So here is the top on. When I try to make it fit my boobs, it folds right here. But if I allow it to kind of just like do this, then it just kind of like the line goes on my boobs and it just looks really awkward. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't really like it because my boobs end here and then this is over here. What do you guys think? Should I keep it? Is it weird? I think this bag would look super cute with it. I got it from Shein. I love it. It is a little shorter than I expected, but it is still super cute. I've got this really cute white top on. I love white tops. They go with everything and it becomes like skinnier in the back, which I really love. And I have this cute floral skirt. I'm not really a fan of the material that much. If I'm going to be honest, it's kind of weird. Um, more like t-shirt material that can catch lint really easily. I also think that this skirt is a little bit loose. I usually like my skirt a little bit tighter. I did get this either in a size 6 or a size medium. You could definitely size down for this one. It is really stretchy. Um, super cute. Makes my butt look good. Uh, yeah, I love this top so much. It is a nice silky... I shouldn't say silky, but very soft material. Definitely not like that t-shirt material. It just ties in the front, it comes separated. And this jean skirt is so cute. I could have gone a size down. I got it in a size six. Like look how much room I have, but I guess I got more room to eat when I go out in this. Uh, makes the booty look good. A lot of the time I will wear things high-waisted, so when I move it up, you can kind of see like a little bit of space here. That's why I said I could have gone a size down. And it looks bomb, like I really love this. I look super cute in this, okay? Hmm. I forgot to mention that I've been wearing pasties with everything that I've been wearing and I got the pasties from Shein. Um, where did I put them? They are super comfortable and honestly, best pasties I've ever tried and especially for the price. And when you remove them, they don't feel like you're like ripping your skin off if that makes any sense. So I definitely recommend those pasties. If I find them, I will show them to you guys real quick. I have no idea where I put them. Hear me out on these shorts. I had a vision for this, but it's not quite living up to my expectations. I feel like it's a little bit too boyish and a little bit too long. I don't know, what do you guys think? I think it's cute, but I'm also a little like, eh, is this really that cute? I'll put up an inspo picture of what I was actually looking for. I feel like this length would be perfect, like a little bit higher, like that. I didn't expect it to be this long. I don't know, I don't, is it cute guys? Should I keep it? Okay, this top is so cute. It makes my boobs look so good and like perky, and I'm not even wearing a bra. Um, I love it. It is definitely more of a see-through, meshy material. I thought it was gonna be more like a shirt, but it's definitely mesh. It's not itchy at all. Usually mesh like itches me so much because I have very sensitive skin. I love this so much. It is a very cute going out top. I just really love the way they make my boobs look. They just look so like nice and like perky. I just love them. This dress is super cute. I love it. It is a nice flowy, baby girl sundress it's not too short but you can wear shorts under it um i wasn't really sure how to tie the straps like this one's more forward and this one's like more up top so i guess however you want to tie the straps you can but yeah it's super cute definitely something that you can just throw on and i love it 
I took a gamble and I got this top in a large because they didn't have any left in my size and it actually fits perfectly. I can just tie it right in the back. My mom actually tied it for me. It looks really pretty. I love this. This is like my milkmaid Disney princess peasant dress outfit. I don't know, I kind of feel like Brandy from the Cinderella like musical thing. I love the slit. I think slits are really important in like long dresses like this because they don't kind of look like a like church dress. I mean, there's nothing wrong with church dresses. It's just, I don't want to walk around in a church dress. So yeah, and it also, you know, lengthens me a lot. Makes me look super tall. I'm only 5'8", so I'm not, you know, that tall. But this makes me look like a model, which I love. So this is one of my favorite tops, definitely going along with the tie-dye trend. But it is super soft. You could definitely tie this to make this work. Looks really nice. Love it. I love this top so much. I got it in three colors. I got it in white, gray, and purple. Super cute. You could definitely uh, button it all the way down or leave some buttons out here. This is definitely a little bit too small. I can tell because of the way it's buttoning. So it's my boobs that are making it not fit. I got this in a medium. So if you're if your measurements are kind of like mine, you may want to size up. While I have this on, I kind of want to show you guys the different bags that I got. So I got this plaid bag, very cute. The strap on this is long, so it's comfortable. Definitely one of my favorites. And I got the same bag in black. This has been my everyday bag. It fits perfectly on my arm, and it's not like that shiny, like cheap leather material. It's kind of like, it has a slight shine to it, which makes it look more genuine. So this brown one kind of got like a little bit too flat, but again, super cute. Definitely something super casual that you can wear with any outfit. So I have this cute little plain white graphic tee with this detailing on the back. But if you really wanted to, you could definitely just flip it around. I mean, though like the neckline kind of looks weird, but there are really no rules to fashion. You can do whatever you want. I do think though I could have gotten away with a small because it is really big. So if you usually get like size six or size medium, a small would be great if you don't want it to be like this big because it is really, really big. All right, this next top is super cute. I think this is more of like a 70s vibe. I'm not really sure. I love the way, well, I tied it like this. You can actually just like tie it in a bow here, but I like it better this way. I think it's really cute, very simple. The material feels really nice and it fits right under my boob. I hate tops that like fit like this because that just looks so bad. So that's one thing that I always look for, something that will just like cup right under and it does that, which is amazing. So this shirt is super weird. I don't know how I feel about it. It's kind of too loose in the boob area. And then it does this weird puffy thing back there, which makes me look like I have a ton of back fat and that's not really flattering. I don't know, I had high hopes for this. I love the color, but it is so weird. This is just a really poor fitting top. Definitely going to return. I got it in another color and this is actually how it comes. This could look super cute on somebody else, but for me, I don't know. I just, I can't make it look good. All right, so this top is very similar to the other style top I just had on that I said I hated, but this fits right. Like this fits my boobs right. Like the back looks great. Everything looks good. So this is definitely more of the style that I'm looking for when it comes to those types of tops. I just really love this top, super cute, very soft material, very, very soft, I love it. I love the ruching, I think it just makes it look super girly and super cute. This dress is really cute but very see-through, like you have to wear nude underwear with this. This is a very simple dress that you can just throw on for like any occasion. It is a little short, but it is still super cute. Okay, so I also got three sunglasses. I got two brown ones and one black one. These are really cute. This, not so much. It looks ridiculous on me. This is the last Milk Bay top I have, I promise. But this is really cute for the summertime. Definitely something you'd want to wear like at night or maybe in the evening because it is hot. It is a little tight around the arms. I did tie it up right here. It doesn't really fit my boobs, but I feel like it's passable more than the other tops. So I am gonna be keeping this. 
definitely going to be a cute staple in my wardrobe. I love it so much. So here's the purple version of the white top I tried on earlier. I paired it with these tie-dye shorts because I just thought it looked super cute together. This is comfortable, but a tiny bit rough. It kind of feels like a white shirt that you bleached maybe and it feels too like, I can't describe it, but very cute. Something that you could go out in, lounge around in. Love this so much. I love the purple top and I also love the tie-dye shorts, super cute. This next item is a sundress. It is very flowy. I love this because like sometimes you just don't feel like throwing on a pair of pants. Like you just wanna wear a dress and it's very comfortable. It's not tight, very flowy. It has that like t-shirt material. I do feel like this type of material will get linty. I definitely could have gone a size down to kind of like cinch in my waist a little bit more because here it kind of like makes my waist look wide. But when I cinch it in, I feel like it gives me like more of a shape. So these two items actually came together. It was a two piece set. I love two piece sets because the outfit's already made for you and you really don't have to think about it. Um, I love the top more than I like the bottoms because I feel like the bottoms look different from what it looked like on the site. The top is this cute little butterfly top and the bottoms fit nice too. It hugs all the right areas and it just looks great. I love it. So this top is more of a sweater material but it's very light so it's great to wear in the summer. Obviously, I would wear a bra with this. Um, I just didn't feel like putting one on. I think this is something that you could definitely get away with wearing during the day or the evening because though it is a sweater material, like it really isn't that thick. And it's super breathable, super stretchy, doesn't feel tight around my arms, very soft material. I just, I love this so much. This shirt I love, but it was a little bit tighter than anticipated. I actually had to put a scarf on my head in order to get it over my head because my head, like guys, my head's pretty big. So yeah, other than that, I love it so much. I love the like print on it. What does it say? Made of sunlight. That is just so cute. I love this so much. Such a trendy little top. Everybody needs a basic Razorback tee in their summer wardrobe. So if you don't have one, I advise you pick one up right now. This is so cute, so comfortable, fits nice around the arms. It's a nice like ribbed material, which I really love. I just think it's super chill, super casual. You go wear pants, a skirt, anything really. This dress gives me vacation vibes, like Greek princess vibes. Like, I don't know, it just, it's super cute, perfect to wear like if you're going on vacation, maybe like the beach at night. Um, this is like a bit looser. If you want it to fit tighter, kind of like this, then I would size down. I hate this top so much, I regret buying it. It like goes up my underpits, which I hate. I feel like I can't even put my arms down. It just feels so awkward. I just hate the feeling that it gives me under my underpits. Like I don't like things like sticking up there and it's tight. It gives me like a little bra roll. I hate it. Like this is a terrible, terrible top. So this is the last item. It is super cute. I think it's like takeout bag inspired. This top I've seen going for like $20 on other sites, but it's actually $6 on Shein. So if you've been wanting this top, definitely pick it up on Shein. It is a little bit more cropped than I thought it would be, but it is still super cute. You could wear it with like low waist pants or like something high waisted, a skirt. Um, it's ribbed material, very comfortable, breathable, very lightweight for the summertime. And I really like it. I look cute. I love this. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to see more haul videos from me, definitely give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I have everything that I purchased in the description box, so everything should be there. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.